Hello everyone, this is Hyperthermal yet again with another sa weekly SAF recap. Let's just get right into it. We're starting off here. This is the weekly of November 11th. A little bit of, uh, I think it was random, but yeah, here's... Here's the main guy for this run, the Silverfish. You sell him for two gold extra, but you lose that amount of gold next turn. Guess an, I guess it's like an interesting sort of like... Get powered now, but like you go into a little bit of debt for it. Very interesting idea, but we're not going to be making it use of that here because we're getting we're trying to get his uh we lose that one we're trying to get the level three win with the silver mission you can't really do that if you know you sell it take the wyvern and the puppy I'm gonna be taking putting some lasagna from the puppy into the silver fish yeah, we lose there. They got chihuahuas and iguanas. So we got another level on the wyvern coming up. We have uh, a couple murloc dudes. I know they're technically not murlocs. That's what is coming to bra my brain at the moment. I take the caterpillar, we're leveling him up. Making it more use out of our wyvern when it levels up occasionally. And we sell we sell it anyway. Oops. I, it was the right choice to sell. Anyway, getting Lasani onto the Silverfish, I'm thinking, okay, yeah, no, I have a Lynx. Let's go Brahmin Chicken to get snipers, buff the snipers, but uh, it doesn't end up working out. Sell the puppy, bring in the Brahmin Chicken. Wait, wait. Yeah, no it, no, it does work out this time around with the Brahmin Chicken. But I, I just didn't get the, um, the achievement. So I get two lionesses there. Alright, so far so good. We're at four wins. And we're getting a level two lioness and an additional lioness. So we're getting a lot of scaling for our sh for units. Very, very good. Uh, I am not making full use of Brahmin Chicken. Brahmin Chicken gives buffs to three snipe pets. I have only one. I'm gonna be rectifying that. And they sniped our guys, so whoops. It looks like we're not getting a problem chicken buffs under the links. It's fine. We made it through there. We got, got a pretty good victory with the um the whole uh donkey situation. Worked out just fine, but again my links keeps getting sniped.
only we can find another Lynx, and there it is, we, we buff it up, and it, it, the team's kind of a little bit samey at this point, so I'm skipping ahead to here. And bring in the Albatross, we have two Lynxes. Albatross is going to buff the Lynxes. Like, it's going to, like, give them more snipe damage. Desire Sensor was kind of working against me on the Brahmin Chicken front. Scary looking team here. It's a defeat. Looking again, but uh, of course the desire sensor kicks in. Not that it matters because boom, there it goes. Got a little silverfish man. Means that now we can just use it for its intended purpose. So here we we're starting off. This is the. What was it? The powerful puddings. We got the Chihuahua, which is a push pet. Pushes enemies to the front. Based on, I think, health. Most health on the enemy goes forward. We don't make it through this one. So you get two lucky cats, and I'm thinking, alright. There's some... Like level three spy cell stuff going on here like with the starfish. My thinking was, hey, the starfish is here. I'm going to get the uh, lucky cat up to like level three. Get some money, get some stats temporarily. Getting the. Uh, Starfish and boom. Transfer all those stats to the next guys over. Because they they changed how Starfish works. If you recall. I already have a Starfish match, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I did it, 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 yeah, it's fine, it's fine, everything's fine. In fact, it's so fine that I think we do manage to get some starfish action going on in this match. This round. No, not round. This game. This individual game. Probably... No, I, I wouldn't say match. I would say match if it was like... Versus... And that's a draw. So I sell our Hercules Beetle there in preparation for the uh, upcoming Starfish that we are absolutely definitely getting. We're doing fine, we're winning. And they, there it is, there's the starfish, we got it. And I get the Leviathan, and people are now going to express hatred towards me, because Leviathan is a bit busted. And it kind of... It kind of dictated the weekly, in a sense. 
but there is there is good, I guess, with how we go. It, it, you know how it goes. I added a dragon eventually. And I sell... I sold... The Leviathan, okay? Granted, damage has already been done. I should have sold the starfish to get the level 3 red dragon. Very unfortunate. But, you know, when you're playing Super Auto Pets and you're like that close, you don't know whether or not you're gonna make it or not. Anyway, we got this last game here. failures. Though I suppose this time around, well, that failure was kind of usual. And we- alright, we're making it through that one. Level up the Umbrella Bird. The Wasp. Wasp is kind of the MVP this game. So we're working on getting the Silk Moth uh, achievement in this run. Because, I mean, I haven't gotten it yet. And it was right there in the shop. At the at, like, right at the start. Did not get a uh, good value off of it, and we lost that one. Putting stats onto the wasp. And here I make a big brain play. I have Umbrella Bird, I get Unicorn. That's a synergy. Get the wasp huge. And, yeah, come on, we don't make it through that. So we're building up our... boss, making it stronger and stronger and stronger, and... I think this is where I make... ...the mistake. I have a level one unicorn. You cannot do. You cannot refresh and buff the ailments on both of my guys. So I have to get a perk or something onto that wasp this turn. Five works. So yeah, that's Venus Flytrap. And yeah, Silk Moth gives three health at level three to friend Darnage to head. Uh, Venus Flytrap, we're gonna make use of it now. Getting another level onto Puppy, I think. At that level three of a mid and I didn't take another unicorn because I, I'm I'm moving out of the unicorn. Wasps is already at big maximum healths. Going with dragons. Making up for that one time where I messed up. Uh, I have Team Spear here for some, I guess, infrequent leveling. And I have Linus yet again. Boom, we 
make it through that one. Putting the lasagnas onto the team spirit. And I'm rolling and rolling and rolling, looking forward. Something. Like another dragon. Get right there, another dragon. The next turn, we're going to be selling it with Vianus in favor for a, another bit of experience for our little, little man. Team Spirit, yes. You can do something absolutely wretched with Team Spirit and Leviathan. I don't do it this time around, because I am not that evil yet. Alright, so that, all right, that was a drop of next time. Getting it. Getting the win. I make... I make a spicy decision. And I add it to level 3 dragon. Is it gonna work out this turn? Am I gonna lose a heart? Because it, it's... We're pretty far in. I don't think we're gonna be losing. Obviously. Why would I be showing it here if it was lose-losing? Add our man... Manticore. Get that burn damage off. Rhino. Very scary. But with 3 HP, that Silk Moth and Dragon, Red Dragon, we did it. It's another uh, three victories, four pets gotten their little red ribbons. Doing great. Alright. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a good week. Enjoy your super auto pets when possible. And remember, 